But I think that uh, Martha Karua is probably the reason why he may be able to, to go through. Be, she, first of all, she's a seasoned politician. Secondly, she brings the women vote uh, and young, young, young youth. Hmm. Uh, of course, for him, he's going on the whole hustler mentality. That's Ruto. Says, these guys have been there forever. They have been in the mix. Us guys have gone from nowhere. It's who we are today. So I'm representing you guys that we're tired of the old. The same thing Bobby Wine was doing. Yeah. You know what I mean? Time for new, new blood. So Martha blah, blah. Karua could be the person who pushes him across the line? I think so. Hmm. Personally, I think hmm. he's... Hmm. Hmm. Yeah, I mean, he's, of course, don't get me wrong, he holds his own weight yeah. as Martha. I mean, as, 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 as Raila, but yeah. Wow. Anyway, it's too close to call. More of the story. Well, either way, either way, there's going to be a new president. At the For end sure. of the day, there'll yeah. be a brand new president brand new sitting president. in the State House of Kenya. With new furniture. With new furniture. New staff. New staff. And new demands. And new demands. Yeah. As we have the same guy, yeah. same staff, yeah. same demands. Yeah, same list of shopping. <laughs> anyway. Onion, they're the same. <laughs> they know it. Same, same. Same, same. Cassava. Same, same. Ali. 20, 26? Yeah. Same, same, same. Speaking of our guy here. Yeah. Mm. I've noticed that the president, I think, gives us a weekly presidential address. Someone tweeted the other day, but it seems these days Sevo is lonely. Yes. <laughs> he must talk to us every yes, day, every, every week. week. <laughs> presidential address that will be starting at 8, which actually starts at 9.30, because time is a factor for it's, us. Yeah. We never keep time. But when he gets over there, he talks to us about the same thing. Is it the same thing? Yes, it is. Just different words. How is it the same thing but different words? It's no. the same thing. Economic problems. The whole world has been suffering economic crisis. Every week. Yeah. Yeah. So we must address. Because you guys are like, no, we are no, suffering but and you're nobody's giving you're leadership. Giving, you're not giving us solutions. So it's the same thing, different words. Electronic cars is the solution. Electronic cars in 20 years. When we have portals. Please. What are you, you, you mean electronic cars can't go through portals? How? They, they, they go through shocks. They no, you tell that. shocks are the same cars. It's all other cars. What do you mean? <laughs> Electronic our cars don't have a, they have a different truck absorber system. Boss, don't forget, our potholes are epic. They are only managed by fuel cars. Yes. <laughs> no, think about it. He comes over there, he tells us, I mean, the last... No, but even with the electronic car thing, I'm like, really, boss? I really? mean, I, I like the vision. Yeah. I get it, yeah, but, but it's, what it's, about... It doesn't solve the now problem. What's the now? The now, the now solution. solution. You're not giving us any now solution. You're talking about... You know, uh, people are struggling, let's be frugal. And many people said, if you're saying let's be frugal, mm. why don't we start with you? No, it's a job. No, with a job. Oh, but I'm not working? You are. I don't have, I don't have issues? Yeah. Oh, please. He used to have four meals a day, he has two. You just don't know it. <laughs> Can you see how he has lost weight? Who? Him. Hey, you want, you want, you want to argue there? Have you weighed him? Ah, you want to argue Have that you weighed him? You How argue. much was he weighing before that he has lost weight? Uh, 68. <laughs> Not 69? No, 68. Yeah, 69. No, 68 is his current. He was on 75. Are you sure? Mm. Okay. Two meals from four. And you know this how? Black tea, now. Marcus. Sweet potatoes, now. <laughs> Don't argue with me on these such matters. <laughs> okay, so he has lost weight because yeah, he's not eating. It's fugo. Frugal. Of course, the cars must move and they must be 20. And that one is this. Yeah, he, he, Ah, thank mm. you very much. Let's mm. go to fuel. It's that, and there must be 20. That's for the office. Can he cut down on his presidential uh, motorcade? It's the office of the president. Yes, cut down. You have to lead by example. You can't tell people, be frugal. Office Tighten your belt. He, but for me, I'll continue. He used to attend 28 functions. He attends only 9. <laughs> ah, Marcus. Frugality in full effect. Marcus, you're a fool. <laughs> <laughs> no, but I mean, at the end of the day, he, he he's not going to... You look after your life. Find a way. In these harsh economic times, they're not, they're not, uh -uh. the economic times are not specific to Uganda. They're global. And if you think you are suffering, ask your friends abroad. We like to, we like to ask, uh, see, compare ourselves to abroad a lot. Ask what's going on abroad. Yeah, it's ten, it's ten but, times worse. But, but, but they are putting steps in place so that they can mitigate the situation now. For example, still no, worse. No, 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 but still, we are going to subsidize. We're going to cut down on taxes. Us! Everything remains the same. Mm. We are not going to do anything for you. Meanwhile, meanwhile, you have to pay huge tax um, prices on fuel. We're almost a thousand markers. Mm. You know, more cars seem to be on the road. <laughs> the people on the road, what are you saying? Because you... people have decided, if I don't go to work, I don't get paid. So I have to pay to be on the road to go to work. But he worked during COVID. 
from home. Yeah, but you see, that was then. This is now market. Actually, me, I'm saying that COVID was in its... And I, again, don't take this the wrong way before people lost point COVID. But COVID was a blessing in disguise. Because you actually found land in COVID th that you could work from home. You all... Because Ugandans were used to moving. That's why traffic was bad. Now they're like, uh-uh. Let's do a Zoom call. I don't have to come. Okay. So Zoom calls are back. I don't have to make it to the office. I can save on fuel. Yeah, we can do a conference Marcus, call. Not every, can... You see, Marcus, you are talking as an elitist. Mm. Not everybody can be on freaking Zoom calls. Please. I need to be on the ground to sell my wares. I need to be on the ground to be able to make I money. Have you noticed that the border borders have tripled? Because they need the money. That's what I'm saying. So people can move. Eh. But Marcus. People can move. Mm -hmm. So move. If you must. In the rains. Which have just started. <laughs> Speaking of rains, when I climate change is real. Anyway, so 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 your president's speech. Actually, your, your, he also talked about, he climate, about change. climate change. Climate change. Huh? He's talking about Europe and mm. how Europe is on fire, and the, the temperatures are crazy. It's scorching us, hot. Yes, but for us, we're getting the floods. I mean, for goodness' sakes, what's happening in uh, in, Bali, in Bali, Capchora, man. From it's, extreme drought to extreme floods, it's, it's, we have reached that place as if India, mm. where it's two extremes immediate. Because I was, I traveled in Western Uganda about three weeks ago. Yeah. The man, you look at a cow and you're like, this one is not lasting two days. It has no grass to eat. It is thin. It is looking for water. Nothing. Yeah. yeah. It was bad. It was Dusty very, very bad. And Dusty. And we were together. I saw. It was terrible, terrible, terrible. But then, immediately after that, two weeks later, the floods come, the rains come, and floods, and again, take the cows. <laughs> so either way, the cows are going. Cows are messed. <laughs> Cows have suffered. Well, I mean, the cows have suffered. They really suffered. Hey, you know another person who has suffered mm. is, I think, artists. Artists can no longer uh, perform in, the, in schools because of the way they were dressing. <sighs> Your sister-in-law, Sheba. And you, you, I don't know if you heard what she said. Sheba? Yeah. Something along the lines of, I'm not their mother. Yeah, yeah like, I, like, it's not my fault if your children... Ch children are morally decayed. But you still have a very huge platform and therefore you do have a sense of responsibility when you step in front of children in a school. And the moment she said that, the person who spoke above her said, and this is the reason why you are being banned. They banned not only her, but generally in general. Yeah. If you don't abide by certain rules. And I think that's good. In I front of school children, you must be, be decent. Be decent. If you are just in public of wow of Malembe concerts, do you blast? Because those things are for adults. Yes, but in front of you've gone to a school. I mean, at the bare minimum, do you see the children dressed like that? Why would you? At the bare and it's apparently the same thing with, with uh, my sister Winnie. Ah, Winnie has been getting a lot of flack. A lot of flack because what she has decided. I mean, hot pants and short jeans. Everybody must see the booty. Did you see she was chased away from Ministry of Internal Affairs for the same problem? But I think that's nonsense. Where does it say when I go to a government institution I must dress in a certain way? No, I just I think she's getting flack for what's been going yeah, on. Yeah, but even them, even them for them to chase her away the way they did. If, First thing if, if it was for real, if it was the, the real case, it's wrong. It's wrong. Absolutely. And they asked her to go and change and come back. Why? Why? I'm going to a, I'm going to a service you're supposed to give me. How does it matter? If I go naked, yeah, that's different. But she was dressed. A jacket, shorts, what uh, the hell? She was in hot pants. As What's if, wrong as with her? As if tights. No, there's no problem there. Yeah, you see you're speaking as a man. <laughs> you're speaking as a man. No, 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 no. They did her wrong. They did her wrong. You think? They did her no, wrong. No, no, no. I think, I think if, we're, if this is what we're sending across the board, then let's send it across the board. Mm, mm, mm. In public offices, schools, if you're on a concert, do you. Now you're going to start telling people in the public how to dress. Do you realize that's what you're saying as Big Brother? Big Brother is watching you. you Government can't... offices, wear a mask, still there. Yeah. A mask, yes, for public health reasons. Yeah. But because I'm wearing hot pants. Women's bums are for public health. <laughs> One zero. <laughs> One zero. You, you, you look at those bums and you think men don't, don't start going mad. Hey. Creates fights with couples there. A guy will knock. A border guy will lose his ground nuts. Wait. <laughs> Are these nuts? These nuts? <laughs> <laughs> Speaking of nuts, there's a guy now who is uh, officially... He got uh, married. Our Honorable FUFA President and MP. Hey, uh, to the Speaker. Uh, Anita Among. Hey, so is she going to change her name to Anita Mangogo? Anita Mangogo? Yeah. Your Speaker is Anita speaker. Among Magogo. 
So, so wait a minute. She become the the, 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 the first lady of football. Oh. <laughs> or, or does he become the the first, the first husband of parliament? Of pal parliament. <laughs> So how does it work in Parliament? This is, I guess it's point of honor, darling. Ah, yeah, yeah. Or does it point of honor? You're your honorable. You're, you're watching, no. Your, your, your Excellency. Yeah. Point of order, your speaker. Uh, point of order, your speaker. Honey. <laughs> I don't know how it works. Darling. Yeah. <laughs> babes, 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 babes. That guy has talked badly. First, <laughs> apprehend. <laughs> How to manage for me, this guy. Kongs. <laughs> no, no, no. We're happy for them. Though. Congratulations. Them. Yeah. Guys, we'll come to the end of our very first episode of The Last Round. Season 1, episode 1. Yeah, it'll be happening on this uh, YouTube channel, The Last Round. And if you want to follow it on our socials, the hashtag is the same. The Last Round UG. One word. Hashtag The Last Round UG. It'll be here every week. One episode. We're back. Absolutely. Go ahead. Follow us on all of our different platforms. The Last Round. And uh, Marcus, hmm? it's been good. It's been good. Good to have you back. Not bad. Yeah. But you drink slowly. Uh-uh. Same, same. What are you saying?